It's really interesting. Um, a client of mine around wanting to taper. One of the uh, this is a cl clinical case that comes up. He wanted to taper his medications. He wanted to get off of it. And I said, sure, that sounds reasonable. Let's set up a plan for that. And all of a sudden, he's like, well, something's going on. My shoulders are getting really tight here. And I said, well, let's just pay attention to that. And so when he starts listening to that, he's like, wow, there's a lot going on in my life right now. He's like, I'm getting a new boss at work. My wife is really stressed out. Maybe I shouldn't do this. Is that what this is telling me? And I say, well, I don't know. Let's just kind of pay attention here. Mm -hmm. and, I, and so then we start this negotiation process with him in this tightness in his shoulders. And, you know, I say, well, do you want to move really slowly and see if it's okay? And he says, well, I don't know. I said, well, just, just, just let's mention that and see what happens in your body. And he kind of is like, I guess that seems okay, you know. Um, what if we, you know, move down, you know, 25 milligrams a month? Let's go really, really slow, okay? And if this feels okay with your system, let's go with that. But if it doesn't feel okay, you may get some of that tightness back in your shoulders, and you need to listen to that, mm -hmm. okay? And then he's like, oh, okay. So I guess if I listen to my body, I can still taper the medication as long as I go really, really slow, and respond if my body doesn't like it. And I say, yeah. exactly. So that's the kind of negotiation I'm talking about, is just listening to what's going on inside as we're moving forward.